First between the lines. Three, two, one, go! Let's see which of these alliances will be going to the semifinals. Over on Blue Alliance, we have some cargo being lined up by CPR on Blue and a hatch panel being lined up by their partners on the other side of that. We have a hatch panel also coming in on Blue from the Commodores over on Red. We've got HV Aerohoctics. They're trying to line up a hatch panel. Looks like they've done so. And there are partners. Cal Robotics going to the cargo depot to pick up some of those cargo points. They're headed back over to the cargo ship for Red. And they've scored. That's a double score, though. Only one cargo ball per cargo bay point counts for points. Blue Lines has the early lead. CPR loading up some hatch panels in that level one of that Blue Lines rocket. They've got two hatch panels on there so far. Over on the other side for that Blue Alliance. Lining and working on a hatch panel being lined up, but here comes some Red Alliance defense as well. Apex Robotics trying to get that hatch panel placed, but HVA Rohoctics playing that defense. HVA Rohoctics pushing them back towards that HAB zone, but it looks like Apex is going to be able to place that cargo panel on the Blue Alliance cargo ship. Their partners, CPR, placing more cargo in that Blue Alliance rocket. Meanwhile, on red, we've got Kale Robotics grabbing more and more cargo. That's more cargo placed in that blue Red Alliance cargo ship. Four pieces placed so far. And Kale Robotics trying to get lined up and place that cargo in their cargo ship, but they're getting some defense coming in from the Commodores. Commodores pushing them back out of the way, preventing Kale Robotics from getting lined up on that Red Alliance rocket. Lots of defense pushing right now in this match. We're under one minute remaining to play. Commodores continuing to block out Kel Robotics from being able to get in the scoring position. Meanwhile, their partners over on the blue side have placed another hatch panel on that Blue Alliance rocket. CPR has placed three hatch panels so far and loaded in two pieces of cargo. And now here comes hatch panel number four from CPR on the Blue Alliance placed for Blue Alliance up to a score of 50. Kale Robotics scores one more piece of cargo despite that defense to get the cargo into that Red Alliance cargo ship, bringing them up to a score of 32. And we're now at the last 30 seconds of the match. We'll see who can climb and if that will make a difference to finalize the score of this match. HVA Rohoctics playing some defense still, but now they're headed back to their hab, looking to do some climbing if they can. Blue Alliance has Apex Robotics up on level three for 12 points successfully. Over on the Blue Alliance, their partners as well. Looks like the Commodore is trying to get to level two. They lift them up and they drop to get up there to level two from the Commodores with four seconds remaining on the Red Alliance. Both machines for the Red Alliance have made it up to level one for three points each. Blue Alliance looks like they made it up on level two for two more of those machines as time expired. Let's wait for those official scores for who will be Blue Alliance with a score of 85 and Red Alliance 38. That's the second win for our seventh seed of the Alliance, meaning.